Seifert had been murdered about two and a half months before I got involved in this and became a crime reporter and started investigating um, the Teamsters in particular. I guess it was during spring break at, uh, in graduate school, I, uh, I wound up going to Chicago uh, for the Gaylor Products trial. Uh, and, and I was there at the federal courthouse, and I, at, during a break in the trial, I saw two guys standing outside talking, and I knew who they were. It was Irv Weiner, and it was Alan Dorfman. Uh, and I intruded on their conversation, and when I asked Dorfman about his role with the mob, uh, his response to me was that he was no different and certainly no worse than any banker or businessman um, who operated um, in America today. That was his position, that he was just a businessman who dealt with large sums of money and, uh, and did it, in his opinion, in a very legitimate way. Strong backing, solid business model, and hits. This is one corporate ladder you don't want to climb. Mob Money, Murders and Acquisitions, premieres Wednesday on CNBC.